Hi everyone, it's Roger here from what's on at DisneyPlus.com. A quick news update for you guys on how Sony is looking to buy Disney's Star India business, which might include a Disney Plus Hotstar. But before we go any further, make sure you do hit that subscribe button to keep up with the latest Disney Plus news. So over the last few months, we've been hearing a lot about how Disney is kind of reorganizing its business, kind of trying to um, narrow down its focus to its core businesses, which include streaming, we've also got the theme parks and theatrical releases. And it's been looking at a number of the assets that it owns and making changes. We've been hearing about them selling the linear channels like the, the potential ABC local networks that they own in the US. They've also been looking at maybe getting a buyer for ESPN to kind of join in as a joint effort. And one of the other things they have been looking at is looking at their Indian business. Now they acquired a huge, huge business in India, Star, um, when they purchased 20th Century Fox. Um, that includes over 70 linear channels. They've also got Star Studios. They're making a whole host of stuff. It also includes the streaming service Hotstar, which they rebranded to Disney Plus Hotstar. And it has got um, loads and loads of subscribers, 50 plus million subscribers. Now they had lost 20 million subscribers after they kind of bailed out on auctioning and trying to get um, what... However, they lost about 20 million subscribers when they decided that they were no longer interested in getting the IPL Cricket League and so therefore saw subscribers leave in huge numbers. They've also stopped having HBO content and now apparently according to the Mint, Sony is now looking into the potential of buying out some or all of Disney's India business. Now this isn't the first company to be involved in talks with Disney. There have been many other interested parties involved in talks with Disney about potentially buying some or all of Disney's Indian assets including New Delhi TV, Sun TV and Reliance Industries Limited. Now obviously with Sony there is a little bit more complication with this because they're trying to get through a merger with Z, um, but that has been something that's been going on for a long time and there's a lot of um, issues going on right now. There's some court cases going through which might delay it going and Sony is apparently getting a bit frustrated with this situation and essentially now is looking at Disney as maybe a potential um, plan B because it would give them access to you know all those linear channels all that extra content. Now I think there is a big question of whether or not Disney is gonna wanna sell Disney Plus Hotstar or whether or not it just sells the hot star section and kind of gets that off and maybe carries on with Disney Plus with just the Disney content like it does everywhere else. Because uh, there's a lot of content on Disney Plus Hot Star that is made specifically for the Indian region. Um, whether or not they sell that assets on or who knows. Um, I could easily see them selling off the studios and the linear networks. Maybe keeping Disney Plus Hot Star going um, so they can continue to make the benefit and boost up Disney Plus. I just feel the idea of them pulling out of the country with the most amount of people in. And a way of them continuing to grow that business seems like not necessarily. You know, If you're going to be focused on Disney Plus globally... Now, Bob Iger has said in the past that not all countries are equal and they might not be in all industries and all areas and stuff. But yeah, to me, that seems like a big step. But they could easily pull out the hot star and get out of that. Um, this also could maybe tie in with what we could see internationally of if they were to sell the hot star or Disney star brand um, to Sony or to another company. You know, maybe we end up seeing with the Star Hub internationally become the Hulu Hub. That could be something that could happen. Maybe they rebrand and relaunch um, Star Plus in Latin America and kind of dump the Star name. Because they only really started using that after they acquired 20th Century Fox. The Star branding, let's be honest, is, is a very generic name. It doesn't really mean a lot, so they could easily get rid of it. But yeah, there's lots of opportunities. Uh, there's going to be some more meetings, I suspect, coming up in the next sort of weeks and months. No real plans have been in place. Disney hasn't confirmed anything. But with now four different companies now interested in buying part or some or all of Disney's India business, this is a unique situation. And I suspect that, therefore, Disney can kind of play maybe them off with each other and try and get some more money. The Indian business used to be worth a lot more than it is right now. The industry is just um, shrinking with, you know, linear dropping. Streaming is not as profitable as they thought. So... Disney, you know, kind of just refocusing their stuff. So very interesting to see what's going on there. Don't know what's going to happen with all this. But yeah, just some more, more interest in buying up this content. Again, I don't think Disney really are able to fully utilize and get into it the same way. You know, they're under pressure from everywhere else in the world. And I think they just want a more simple global system. And maybe that is what they're looking at. And also, you look at their linear business. They've been getting out of that in every other country. You know, we've had nearly all of our channels closed down here in the UK, except for National Geographic. 
In some countries, they don't even have that anymore. So I wouldn't be at all surprised if the linear business side of things is got rid of completely and sold off. And maybe they get rid of the studios that are making content and they just focus on delivering things like Marvel and Star Wars and the 20th century stuff and just give that option to people in India as well through just standard Disney Plus. Who knows? But very interesting. I'd love to hear your thoughts on all this in the comments below. Remember to go check us out over at whatson at disneyplus.com. Like, follow, and subscribe, and I shall see you guys soon. Laters.